try to make these as safe as possible. It starts for us with the codes and standards. You have the International Code Council, which is the ICC, that creates the International Fire Code, the International Building Code. We have the National Fire Protection Association, the NFPA. We also have to have standards testing. UL has UL 9540, which is the listing for battery energy storage systems. You look at all the codes, the codes will require a UL 9540 listing for all batteries. And the test is the 9540A test. So these have all been updated and worked on after McMicken, after um, Victoria um, in Australia, after Moss Landing, after all the fires, we're doing a much better job about getting everyone together in a room and creating better codes. And that's the key to make these things safer. Better codes, but working as a group. Because nobody wants me alone to make up code. Um, at that Scottsdale um, electrical vehicle fire, we had talks amongst the Valley Fire Marshals that we were going to require every tow yard in the Valley to have a spot set aside, 50 foot clear space, so that if we had an electrical vehicle car on fire, that we could put it there and safely put it on their lots. I ran into the owner of a tow company that was helping us get rid of the vehicle. And I talked to him about that and I said, hey, you know, this is what we're thinking. He goes, if you require me to provide a 50 foot clear space, that's probably 10, maybe 15 cars. He goes, you will put all of us out of business. Because once again, I didn't do what I was supposed to do and I didn't reach out to the industry like I should have. So this is why we need to come together. We need help coming together as partners to make sure the codes are correct.